My name is Hannah Thomas, and I'm a PhD candidate here at Cornell University, and I study plant biology. So I personally study tomatoes. Uh, more specifically, I study a really cool thing called grafting. And so here's a quick video of what a tomato graft looks like. First, we'll start by cutting two different tomato plants in half. Next, we're going to cut a slit into the bottom part of one of the plants. Then we can remove most of the leaves from the top and cut the top plant into something we call a wedge, where it looks very pointy. Now we're able to take the pointy part and put it into the slit, and we can hold that together with a clip. And now we have a grafted plant. We're here in the Frank Lab. So this is the room where we do all of our experiments. So do you want to take a look around? Let's go! I decided to become a plant biologist because there are a lot of people living on the world, and it's important that we're able to grow enough food to feed everyone, and plants are a very important part of that. My favorite plant is actually the coffee tree. Coffee arabica is its Latin name, and a really fun fact about coffee is that the beans that we make coffee out of actually come from the inside of a fruit that they call a cherry. I actually have to go pick some tomatoes. Do you guys want to come with me? Awesome, let's go. Oh, hey guys. Do you want to go visit the greenhouse with me? A greenhouse is a specialized building where we can grow plants indoors all year. This is because the greenhouse is specially heated and has a lot of water in the air, so the plants are really happy, even in the winter. Do you want to go see what we're growing? These are what tomato plants look like. And you can see on our plants, we have tomatoes. Let's harvest some tomatoes. When you grow tomatoes at home, you might just grow them to eat them. But in a research environment, we collect the tomatoes to get important information about the fruit and the plant. Look how many we collected. I'll see you next time, guys.